this cylindrical drone could one day help detect and monitor wildfires. The Firefly, created by a team from Stanford's School of Engineering and Sweden's Linköping University, sports one fan propeller on the inside of its 3D printed body. Mohammed Danish, a Stanford graduate student working on Firefly, explains how it works. It takes in all the air from the sides through the mesh here. That is the air intake. And taking the air from the sides and blowing it downwards kind of generates a thrust. More like a rocket, but there is no fuel combustion happening here. And these vanes kind of guide it precisely of how to guide the airflow so that it stabilizes itself and stays in the air. When launched in a wooded area, Firefly ascends to just above the canopy, performs a full 360-degree panoramic scan, then returns to land. The drone's sensors capture video, telemetry, and environmental readings, which are wirelessly sent in real time to the ground controller. The initial prototype looked like a traditional drone, but Danish says the team changed the aerodynamic architecture to help with its weight. We wanted the lightest and most rigid material so that it can get through the trees quickly, light so that we don't want to have extra weight on a firefighter's backpack. Firefly has a maximum altitude of 200 feet, and from its launch point, a maximum horizontal range of about 100 feet. Danish says outside of firefighting, Firefly could be used for search and rescue in the wilderness and in tight spaces where a traditional drone may have trouble. Mm -hmm.